So in the last two hometown videos, we had the players from Texas beating the players from California and then the team of Florida players beating the Georgia team. Today, we're going to have Texas versus Florida. So in case you guys forgot, these are what the teams are looking like. Texas right here, Miles Garrett, Trent Williams, Patrick Holmes. It's a very, very good team. Uh, you can see why they beat the California team. But the Florida team is also pretty solid too. They got the Bosa brothers, Derrick Henry's the halfback, and of course, Lamar Jackson is the QB. So I think this is going to be pretty close guys and of course we're gonna do a five game series so whenever a team loses is gonna get a random position upgraded to a 99 overall let's get into game number one all right here we go quarter one of game number one let's see how things go as the florida team doesn't get their extra point but get a touchdown they get a second touchdown they're up 13 and nothing after the first quarter and it looks like texas has a fourth down here so florida's gonna get the ball right back is this gonna get ugly real fast by the way i did not keep the upgrades you know over from the last video too so they're all back to like the normal upgrade dude what is going on in this game though 27 to nothing at halftime what is happening if i were to predict game one i thought texas was gonna win i was definitely not expecting 27 nothing florida at halftime but we've seen some crazy comebacks in the second half in these videos so let's see if texas can make a little bit of a comeback in the third quarter they finally get a touchdown they get the ball back they get another touchdown and it's a two touchdown game going into the fourth quarter so florida has the ball to start the fourth quarter let's see if they can extend their lead it looked pretty bad in the third quarter for them and wow interception yeah let's just get into it earlier because this is a big drive for texas already let's see if they can score quick Ooh, good breakup patrick mahomes dropping back to pass on second down he might be looking to air this out he is wow wide open geez someone's gotta cover him that's a big first down for texas by the way i do want to mention the list i was going off of for these hometown teams i think went off of birthplace so it's a little bit weird with that but hey good run i just want to mention that because a lot of people were saying trevor lawrence should have been on the georgia team which i do agree with but he wasn't born in georgia that's why he wasn't i didn't see him on the list but anyways Big second down, big first down, and Texas is on a bit of a drive here. In field goal range, but they need touchdowns anyways. They're going to run the ball. It's a blumble! Did they get the ball back? I think they got it back. Wow, that could have been an absolute disaster for Texas. J.K. Dobbins got to hold on to the ball there. This is a big spot, man. Can't be fumbling. Close to the first down, but don't get it. I would say they're in four down there, so third down, but... I mean, it doesn't matter because they're not going to even get to the fourth down. Another first down for Texas. I would love to see a bit more sense of urgency, though, because they're down by two scores. It's about to be the two-minute warning. But if they can score on this play, they're going to be in a pretty good spot. Also, they still have all three timeouts. So I guess they are in an okay spot, but they're kind of relying on the defense. Snap the ball. Thank you. Right before the two-minute warning. They're going to run the ball? Eh, all right, I guess. I guess the clock was going to stop anyways, but I'm not a big fan of running the ball. They're going for the end zone, though. There we go. Texas making it a one-score game. Cortland Sutton touchdown. That's so big. But the Texas defense got to step up here and stop Florida's offense still. Can't really afford to give up a first down. They're going to run out Derrick Henry. He gets absolutely stuffed at the line of scrimmage. I wonder if they're even going to think about throwing the ball here. Derrick Henry run again. Stuffed once again. Wow. This is going to be an interesting third down though. Does Florida throw the ball here or are they just going to run? They're throwing the ball. Okay. Lamar Jackson dropping back. Going for the first down. Did he step out early? No. He got the first down. Wow. Texas Texas is still not out of this, but they got to get the stop here. Stuff Derrick Henry once again. He got a few yards this time. I'm going to assume that Florida is just going to run the ball back to back to back here. Still getting a decent bit of yards, but it's third and four now. So best case scenario, if they could get the stop here, Texas is probably going to get the ball back with what, like 20 seconds, 25-ish seconds, something like that. But got to stop Derrick Henry, and they get the stop. They do punt it a little early here, which has cost some teams in the past oh touchback okay only nine seconds it ain't looking good for texas so at this point i think texas is kind of hoping for like a defensive pass interference which has happened i think twice or three times in these videos Ugh, throwing it inbounds that's the game so game number one goes to florida but like i said earlier texas is going to get a random player upgraded to a 99 overall now so let's see what player is going to get upgraded to a 99 overall and it's going to be their tight end and i totally forgot that tight end was a super weak position for the texas team so i guess we're going to upgrade kylan granson to a 99 overall and because this was such a weak position group for them that's a massive upgrade so i think texas Texas getting that 99 overall tight end is going to change things a lot here. And I mean, they made a comeback, right? So I'm sure they're going to score some points in the first half. Let's actually see if that happens though. So they get the ball to start off and there we go. We got a touchdown for them. 7-0. Florida is on a bit of a drive to start off the second.
second quarter, though, so close game, but do they end the drive? Only three points. They get the ball right back, though, and score a touchdown, but they keep missing extra points. I don't know what's going on with that. This is a back-and-forth game right now. I really like that. 23-21 at halftime. A completely different story from game number one. This is definitely things that we like to see right here, so... Only three points once again, and wow, that was a really, really short third quarter. 29-26. Can Florida take the lead in the fourth quarter here on this drive? They don't. Which means that Texas is now going to look to extend the lead and make this a two-score game on this drive. Can they do it? And they do. Big touchdown. So now it's the Florida team that's down by two scores in the fourth quarter. And Lamar Jackson taking off, but sliding a little bit early. Something I would love to see in Madden 24 is like a better sense of urgency from the CPU. But hey, big first down. What I don't like is it's hit the two-minute warning. They're not even past midfield yet. Why are we running the ball? What? Do they not realize they're down by two scores here? What are they? doing and now they had to call a timeout too so this is looking real bad for florida finally aired out a little bit back to hollywood where was that earlier on this drive though yeah i don't believe in this florida team coming back to win this game but you never know i guess kind of like, with these dump offs they're definitely not winning this game 40 seconds third and eight Go for the end zone. What's it? He's wide open. Mike Evans is going to get into the end zone. Oh, he's down at the one. And he didn't get out of bounds. Oh, no. All right. One yard away. Kind of surprised they didn't run it here, but Lamar's going to take off. Just run into the end zone. What do you do? <laughs> Why did he run it all the way outside? Super weird. He got the touchdown. Comes down to an onside kick now, though. So I kind of messed up. I sim past the onside kick by accident, but very clearly, Texas got the ball back here. So they win game number two. It's tied up, but Florida is now going to get a 99 overall player. So let's see who that player is going to be for Florida. And it's going to be, oh no, quarterback. That's so good. So yeah, that's going to be that Lamar Jackson is going to be a 99 overall once again. Let's see what happens in game number three. Before we hop into the next game make sure you guys are subscribed so you don't miss out on any future video all right here we go game number three i want to see another close game like it was in game number two let's see if that 99 lamar upgrade is gonna be uh making things a blowout again though but hey texas strikes first florida answers right back texas taking the lead at the end of the first quarter i still think the tight end upgrade is more significant than the lamar upgrade though just because of how bad the tight end position was for texas they extend their lead here and oh no this is looking bad this is looking hey i was worried about a blow up i thought it was gonna be florida void out texas Ugh. how do we go from a super close game in game number two florida gets a 99 overall quarterback and they're getting blown out now let's see what the second half brings us so third quarter time 31 7 florida's gotta start answering here they get a big touch and a two-point conversion too. Answering right back, and it's a touchdown game going into the fourth. Big turn of events there in the third quarter, but Texas is looking to extend the lead here to start the fourth quarter. Can they do it? They get a field goal, and a field goal makes it a two-score game, so Florida kind of needs to get any sort of points here. Touchdown would be big, right? But any sort of points oh they don't even get past midfield yikes yeah florida kind of needs to get like a quick stop here let's see if they can do that they give up more points yikes not looking good ah uh, they're in an even worse spot than last game 18 points three score game oh man they get a first down but gotta start airing this out man gotta start getting this in the end zone like again they love these dump offs at least they're past midfield now though right but again get this into the end zone quick throw again oh he doesn't even catch it here we go third down First down will be nice. That's much better, though. Get more than just a first down. Hurry this up, though, guys. This is, like, super unserious from Florida right now. I don't know what they're doing. Need to see more from them super fast. Yeah, I, this game's over. I'm already ready to call it. This game is going to be over. They're down by three scores. They're barely moving the ball down the field. Like, I really don't know what they're doing. The good news for Florida is they're going to get another upgrade. And hopefully, that upgrade is going to avoid whatever we just saw in this game. Florida's going to need this upgrade to be pretty significant because they are facing elimination. They're down two games to one now. Let's see what their next upgrade is going to be. It's not... We're not upgrading the kicker, okay? The wheel loves to give... I should just remove the kicker punter from this wheel, but they're going to be upgrading left outside linebacker. That might be one of the Bosa's. It is going to be one of the Bosa's as Joey Bosa is now a 99 overall. Hopefully, he can get after Patrick Mahomes if Florida wants to take this to game number five. So here we go. Game number four. Florida needs to win this to take this to a game number five. Let's see if a little home field advantage can come into play finally for them as the first quarter, not a lot happening, but Texas do get a touchdown. Maybe the Joey Bosa upgrades helped them out a little bit, although, I mean, Texas scored, so I guess. We need the offense to do something 
some. Okay, Florida ties up to start the second quarter, which is nice. Big drive for them at the end of the second quarter, too, and they have the lead at halftime. The third quarter has been a super interesting quarter in this video so far. Let's see how this goes as Texas ties it up and a lot of back and forth going there. So, hey, guys, we got a tie game going into the fourth quarter. Florida has the ball to start off the fourth quarter. Let's see how this drive goes for them. Can they get any sort of points? Big drive, big touchdown. They have the lead. So, very big touchdown because they want this to go to a game five. Obviously, Patrick Mahomes is airing this out to pick it. Pick it. No, you got to pick that off. That was thrown right to you. Ooh, yikes, yikes, yikes. Is that going to cost Florida big first down they get close to midfield for texas this has gotten super interesting real fast and what an interception wow diving catch diving pick jc jackson clutching up for florida there can they put this game away now any sort of points here could be big for florida i mean it could be ggs for Florida. airing this out oh no lamar absolute duck i mean that ball was going like this and Texas is right back in it. Deshaun Elliott with a clutch, clutch pick there for Texas. I can't believe. Why are they throwing the ball, though? So in game three, they refused to air this ball. I mean, look at that duck, though. Yikes. But then they, for some reason, went the lead the air. It makes no sense. Interception on back-to-back -back plays, though. Wow. Very crazy. Texas just running this ball. This is a big Bit. I mean, he's still going. Wow. I still can't believe Lamar first play just airs it out. An absolute dug. I think he got hit by the lineman or he was like, you know, you know how it is. Jeez, that was close to a pick. And somebody is injured for Florida. Not good. The good news for Florida is they Texas still needs a touchdown and they stuffed J.K. Dobbins this time. Can Florida get the stop on third and one? It's going to be another run from J.K. Dobbins. It's a big run for J.K. Dobbins and he's Oh, I thought he was going to score there, but he gets down to the seven-yard line. What a run from J.K. Dobbins. Just shaking off one of the Bosa's there, too. Speaking of the Bosa's, I actually don't see Joey Bosa on the field for Florida right now, so that's a bit of a concern, isn't it? As, wow, Patrick Mahomes wide open, Jalen Waddle, And it's an extra point away from being a tie game, but dude, look how wide open Jalen Waddle was. <laughs> Super important extra point, and I mean, it's Justin Tucker. He's obviously gonna make it. Hey, Lamar Jackson, how about not throwing an interception this time, okay? Yeah, stick with the dump off game. It actually makes sense right now to do that. Minute and a half left, quick throw, quick first down. First down. A little over a minute left. Airing this out to a wide open Mike Evans. And they are in field goal range, guys. So now Florida is going to be looking to kill some clock here. First down could be pretty much GG's. But yeah, just run the ball. Burn their timeouts. It's a good call. Hopefully they just run the ball here because it would be stupid to throw the ball. First down could be big. He's close, but I think he's just short. Wow. This does mean that Texas is going to have a little bit of life here. And also, Florida's kicker, and I love Eddie Pinheiro, but Florida's kicker is not Justin Tucker. So, this could be quite interesting, but he should be able to drill this. And, yep, they take the lead. But, hey, Texas has Patrick Mahomes as their quarterback, and... That's a guy you could trust in. Nice sideline throw. Like, there's only, like, what, three or four quarterbacks I would trust on a game-winning drive with no timeouts left. And Patrick Mahomes is one of them. Get out of bounds. Gets out of bounds. Very, very efficient drive so far. Getting past midfield. Ooh, that's the first play I don't really like, but just got to hurry it up, right? It's not looking like they're in much of a hurry here. A uh, lot of times getting burned off right now. They are going to let, like, 10 seconds burn off the clock. They still need, like, 10 yards to get into field goal range. So, uh-oh. That's going to be the game. Wow. It looks so good. And then I mentioned it. And yeah, it's two stupid plays. But hey, guys, that means we're going to go to a game number five. But Texas is going to get an upgrade right before that. So for the final upgrade of the video, Texas will be upgrading their left outside linebacker, which means that Max Crosby is now a 99 overall. Who is going to win this video in game number five? So it all comes down to this game right here. Cowboys are the home team since they lost the last game. So let's see if the little home field advantage comes into play. But yeah, let's start off with this first quarter as the Texas, I said Cowboys, didn't I? Texas is the home team, and but Florida has the lead after the first quarter. And they got the ball to start off the second quarter here. Do they finish this drive with anything? Oh, okay. They get a touch or get a field goal. So touchdown lead for them. 
Texas only getting field goals right now, and it's a touchdown game at halftime. A little bit of a low-scoring game so far. Let's see if the second half is going to be a little bit different. The third quarter, like I've said, kind of been an interesting quarter so far in this video. Florida extending their lead, but Texas finally getting a touchdown. Florida, two-score lead, though, with that field goal at the end. And unfortunately for Texas, it looks like they're on a fourth down to start off this fourth quarter. So... Yeah, Florida's gonna get the ball. Oh no, they actually went for it on fourth down there. So Florida has the ball at the 31 on this drive. Let's just see if they can finish this drive and, you know, make it a three score game. Second down, run, Derrick Henry kind of trucking that guy over for the first down. Somebody on the Texas defense gotta step up here and force a turnover or something, but Derrick Henry's just rumbling and tumbling forward. And Florida's starting to burn some clock. I think they've already burned a minute off the clock on this drive. Ooh, that might be defensive pass interference, actually. There it is. Defensive pass interference. So, free first down for Florida. And now it's a first and goal situation for Florida, too. Lamar dropping back, going for the end zone. And he gets it to Dalvin Cook, I believe. Yep, it is. And that makes it a three-score lead for Florida. Things are looking real bad for Texas. So, it's looking like game four is going to be like the best game of this video so far i mean hey texas just got an upgrade they're down by more but wow what a throw for patrick mahomes okay hey, it ain't over yet guys let's see like you know throws down the field i don't like these quick balls when they're down by three scores especially when they stay in bounds they got themselves a third down the i guess they could still kick a field goal here but padros airing this out for the end zone wow that was almost caught <laughs> this could potentially be the game right here they kind of need to just get this first down but wide open Jalen waddle for Get the first down. That's a big touchdown for Texas. And they're right back in this game. They're going for an onside kick here, which makes a lot of sense, but easy recovery for Florida. But they're still not out of it yet. They can get a defense to stop here. Gotta stop him here, though. Cannot give up any first downs. And that's a big, big first down play. Probably gonna be the final play before the two-minute warning. Let's see if Texas can get another stop. That was a huge first down stop there. Oh no. Oh no, Texas. Derrick Henry first down. I mean, that was just a wide open hole for Derrick Henry. That was real bad. So they're still not out of it. But yeah, got to start burning timeouts. Third down. Florida throwing the ball here. Okay. Oh, Lamar just might take off and... All right, I mean, to stop, but they're in field goal range. All right, let's see if Eddie Pinier extends the lead. Still going to be a two-score lead, but now it's a two-touchdown game. We've seen Patrick Mahomes air the ball out. He's got to do it on this drive. They have no timeouts. I... <sighs> He doesn't even get out of bounds there either. Oh, that's so bad. That's terrible, dude. Gotta air it out. Like, just throw some bombs out here, Mahomes. <sighs> Sideline throw. Gets out of bounds this time, at least. So, yeah, a little over a minute left. Okay, quick throw inbounds across the middle of the field. A lot of times gonna get killed here. I think they should start going for the end zone here, but another quick throw unserious. It's gonna be over, I think. And Lane Johnson's hurt for Texas. Yikes. 32 seconds. End zone shot, please. Okay, that's much better, but he's still across the middle of the field. I think it's over, guys. I think it's over. Final play of the game. They're down by two scores. They're going for the sideline. It doesn't even get out of bounds. And that's how they lose. That's how they lose this video. We had some super interesting games, but in game number five, Florida wins this entire video. And I guess they're kind of like the mini champions between the four teams that we made. I don't know if there's other states that we can make full teams out of, so I'm going to look into that. If you guys know for sure that there's other states that I can make, definitely let me know in the comments and I'll try to get that done for you guys. But yeah, that's going to be it for this video. YouTube recommends that you watch this video next and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.